Hi everyone and welcome back again. So I've done another set on my flexi hand. This time I thought I would do like a sort of like a, a new year's set and instead of going for your traditional like black and silver or black and gold, I decided I was going to try some white and gold nails. So coming in on most of all of these nails, I'm just using um, Glitter Bell's Snowdrops White. So on the pinky finger here, I'm going to do an ombre. So I'm just building up the the white here um, about three quarters of the way up the nail. And then on the middle finger and the index finger, these are both going to be uh, full white nails. So I'm just going to let you watch that. And on the thumb, this is going to be a glitter ombre as well, but this time the glitter is going to fade down from the tip rather than the cuticle. So I'm just going to place the white at the cuticle area, get it as neat as possible, and then just blend that down the rest of the nail. And I'll just keep coming in with beads until I'm happy with the colour. So now I am coming in with the glitter and this one is from Sparkle Supplies UK. Again, I have a discount code for them and I shall pop it in the description box. And this one is called Pot of Gold and it's just a beautiful sort of like, well obviously it's a gold glitter but it's not like that yellow gold, if that makes sense. It's just a really beautiful colour of gold. So I'm just popping that on, I'm getting it neat round the cuticle and then I'm just blending that down the nail. You'll see me just drag away some excess, I didn't want it to cover um, all of the white too much. So moving on to the ring finger and this is going to be a full nail of the pot of gold. 
And then over the top of that, I'm coming in with some broken gold from Glitter Bells and just popping a little bit of that over this one. So onto the middle finger here and I'm coming in with that broken gold from Glitter Bells and I'm just doing like a sort of swoosh along the middle of the nail and bring it up one side and down on the other and I just play about with that until I'm happy with where it's sitting. And then on the thumb is going to be that pot of gold at the tip and I am just going to blend that um, back towards the cuticle area. So now I'm just going to come in and cap these nails and glass slippers and again I'm sure I only just cap the two. I don't know even why I leave capping in, that must be the most boring part to watch of any set of nails is someone just capping nails. I should really just cut these bits out and then just go straight to the top go. <laughs> um, obviously I filed these off camera. It's just not that easy on a hand that doesn't move. So after I'd filed these nails, I decided that the pointer finger was a little bit too plain. Um, so I'm going to come in here with some stamping. So I'm just going to stamp on a set of lips. I didn't know what else to do. I thought I had maybe like a firework sort of stamping plate, but if I did have it, I couldn't find it. So I went for some gold lips instead. I know it's not very New Year-ish, but... It was the best I could come up with instead of just leaving it plain. I really should have just stuck some um, Swarovski crystals on it. That would have been pretty nice as well. But I went with a set of lips instead. So I'll just let you watch this. So 
the best of it is too, I didn't even get it lined up properly, like the black outline over the gold lips, so, but hey ho, never mind. Um, so now we're just going to top coat these nails and that's the end of the video. So I hope you enjoyed this one and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!